The biggest problem in today's healthcare industry is uh, the rapidly diminishing or rapidly vanishing quality of uh, a new grad coming into a room with a gleam in their eye and saying, I want to make a difference. That quality is completely evaporating from today's healthcare reform and healthcare industry. The reason for that is there's an absolute huge disconnect between the administrative body of the hospital and the care providers. There is absolutely no connection between the bedside and the administrative uh, component of the, uh, of the hospital. So that disconnect has created a fragmentation within the institution. Second of all, the huge influx of working force into the healthcare industry has been uh, recently, because of the uh, economical hardship, uh, healthcare professions has been tagged as being recession proof. So most people, they step into the healthcare field, even though that's not really their desire, their call, but they would provide them, you know, financial security. So you have uh, a new workforce that doesn't really have the predetermined mindset for a healthcare professional. So they're doing it just to collect the paycheck. That has been uh, another component. Right. So it's the disconnect between the administrative body and the caregivers and uh, the mad dash of integrating technology into the hospital setting, such as setting up uh, PCs to every bedside and scanning armbands and uh, scanning medications. What that cumulatively has an effect in uh, making the healthcare provider more task-oriented and uh, more impersonal type of a care. In other words, the current uh, administration and current uh, regulations pushes a healthcare provider to be more automated, task-oriented type of a professional rather than human touch and healing process. The reason I bring the VMAX philosophy again, the VMAX philosophy builds each and every single caregiver to their full potential where they can actually deliver optimal patient care because they do care about their patient and they convince their patient that they will make a distinct difference in their status.